everyone. Thank you for tuning into my channel. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Before we begin, the only tool you'll probably need is a number 2 rubber sand or a flathead depending on your panel. Next we'll need proper PPE wear, safety glasses just in case there's sparks flying over the panel, and some gloves in case your hand slips and touch the panel. Hopefully that will not happen. <coughs> Step number one, put on your PPE wear. Next, I'm gonna take off all the screws off my panel cover. Now safely remove the cover. Now I will show you the areas that you should not touch. It can be very dangerous and you could die. So this part is live, energized, you should not stick your finger in it. This area, the center plate, the center piece, you should not touch. It's also energized. And the wires that are sticking out of the breaker. And the compression screw for the wire. So try to stay away from those points. If you still feel unsafe, you can just turn off the main breaker, then you'll be able to touch wherever you want in the panel. As long the main breaker switch is turned off. So remember, do not touch a centerpiece. In this video, I will show you how to install a double pole breaker and a single pole breaker. This is a Siemens double pole 40 amp breaker. Before I put this breaker in, I want to make sure it's in the off position. Very important. Now this corner of the breaker, this little section, I want to make sure it slides underneath these hooks. Looks like a hooking tab. I want to slide it in place. And once I slide it in place in the corner, it's my pivot point. I want to make sure these two tabs slides in place into these two slots. And make sure it's right and tight into that corner. Now I should be able to slide this breaker right in place. Oh fuck, it's on. You need to put the breaker right close into the corner. Once I have it in place, I should be able to slide this breaker in very nicely. There you go. Now I can put the wires in.
make sure it's nice and tight. Do a tug test. Make sure the water doesn't pop right out. Now I'll do the same for the next wire. Do a tug test, that's good. That's how you install a 40 amp breaker. When you install any other type of breaker, it's the same type of deal, same process. Thank you everybody for watching this video. Remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Peace out.